Alright guys, so I wanted to do a little update on my RC micro car here, the desert truck. Just do a little uh, overview of what I have here and a little drive. Haven't driven this thing for probably like three years. Maybe took it out like once or twice every once in a while. Haven't driven it much. I drove it a lot when I first got it. Have tons of parts for it. I went ahead and put in the bearings and the wheels and did a couple little upgrades to it. As you can see here I got brand new LiPo battery. And I have one over here charging as well right now. And it wasn't powering on the car, so that LiPo might be dead. Because uh, it wasn't even turning on the car at all. Uh, but I have this brand new one. Hopefully it's still good. And I have the stock nickel metal hydrate. Transmitter it came with is uh, not 2.4. It's the older AM system. I have lots of parts. Different spring sets. I got lots of parts for this car just in case I ever needed parts. And I haven't used many. Extra motor in case I ever need it, in case you know they're hard to find in the future. And tons of different types of wheels. Stock uh, chargers off uh, batteries there. So pretty cool little car. This car I've had a lot of fun with. It really drives well for a little two-wheel drive car. The steering isn't great, but I've uh, replaced the steering. And actually, if you see here, these are not the original steering uh, links here. These, I put these on. This is just plastic that I cut holes through and connected. Because the original steering links look like this. And they work, but they're a little bit more flimsy. As you can see, the ones I put on are much thicker and bigger and just stronger. So I found with this kind of little mod I did, just cutting up pieces of plastic, I think it's part of like a CD case. Um, it made the steering work really nice. So you can see I got some scratches on the bottom just from jumping and stuff, but the car's never had any major damage. It's It's been really nice. So let's go ahead and set up a little uh, course in here and do some driving. Alright guys, we got the Losi Micro Desert Truck here and the Nickel Metal Hydrate battery charge first. I'm going to do some full speed, uh, just kind of, you know, flying around the room at full speed so you guys can kind of see how fast it goes uh, with the Nickel Metal. Then we'll do this course a little bit, but first we're just going to, this is full speed here. I got my throttle all the way up. And as you can see, it actually is going to do pretty good at turning and not flipping. It can, it can turn on this carpet at a pretty high speed here and not flip over. This is all full speed. I got my throttle all the way in. And, you know, it flips here and there, so you got to be careful. But actually, it has pretty good, um, um, you know, pretty good balance for its size and, uh, you know, for being able to turn that quick. So that's one thing I like about it for indoors. You can really make this thing zoom around. Now I haven't driven an RC car actually in like over a year. So, so I'm not going to do so good at this course. But as you can see here, it has nice control with the new steering I put in. The steering still is a little bit, um, a little bit, I guess I would say tight. It goes more than I want sometimes. I could use maybe a little bit like a uh, looser steering to have a little bit more control over it I feel like it moves more than I want it to but overall it's a pretty damn nice setup and the car really drives great you can do nice little jumps with it and once I gain my bearing again and get my fingers again and muscle memory back I'll be able to go around this a lot better so as you can see a nice little car fun to set up little courses and mess with the cat And as you see, I'm not doing very good at keeping in the lines. I'm not really trying that hard. So we're going to go ahead and just circle the uh, course once or twice more here. And then put in the LiPo so we can see the difference. And I really enjoy the LiPo with this car, especially for outside. Indoors, I'll use the nickel metal hydrate. But outside, you'll use the LiPo because you get so much more speed. It's ridiculous how powerful this is with the LiPo battery. For its size, it's just so fast. So one more, one or two more jumps here. Hopefully I'll do the course better with the light bulb. I'm just kind of just kind of showing you guys driving around. All right, one more full speed. See, that's pretty crazy. That's all full speed, and it's uh, even hitting stuff. It's not sitting over. Oh, we're stuck. <laughs> all right, so let's go ahead and get the light bulb. Oops, and try out the light bulb. 
All right, the lipo charged up. We got it in there. And I don't know if you can hear this, but there's some interference, like I said. Uh, I just brought the transmitter close. I am not holding the transmitter, and it's moving on its own. Transmitter's over here. So there's a little interference for some reason, but overall, it's been working pretty good. So let's go ahead and show the speed here. And I'm not going to be able to keep this very good here. Um, the speed is going to be really fast. So like now, now it will tip probably if I was to do like full speed, but now it's crazy fast and actually it's still holding this carpet pretty good. I mean it just flipped there right when I was talking about it, but it actually was holding pretty good. Let's go ahead and do some um, more fast and then some jumps. As you can see how how much different it is, and it's hard to show the actual full speed in here because it is a smaller area. <coughs> so, all right, so let me go ahead and try to run this course a little bit. Looks like my steering term needs a little adjustment. <laughs> the jumps are uh, stronger, that's for sure. Let me get back and do some more jumps here. Horrible control right here, just because it's so fast and crazy that. Uh, it's hard to control, even like a, ooh, nice big jump. Even like a quarter push on the throttle really gets this thing up and moving now. So on a, a little indoor course like this, it's pretty fast. But these jumps are a lot more fun on the uh, light bulb here because we're really getting air. And even though I'm not going around the course very well, it's still fun. Oh! <laughs> I'm gonna have to look at that on video. That might have looked cool. Uh, car attack in the cat. All right, I'm gonna try to go around the course like five times here. I'm gonna have to go slow probably without going in the track. My jump side, I'm jumping the wrong way. That every time I jump, I kind of go in the track. A little better, not going super fast, but well, flipped over there, and I wasn't even going that fast. I mean, like any car, it can flip, but overall, I'm fairly impressed with uh, how it's working still. So, Thing is like uh, five years old, I think I've had this thing for at least five years, and it's still working great. Flipped it over here. Nope. Oh. Do a couple more circuits and then a little bit more speed for you guys to see. So I just wanted to bring this car out because Losi makes some really great micros, and even though these things are old, Losi still has them, I believe, for sale. They're not that expensive. And they really drive good. There are some newer micros out from Low C as well. And lots of them are, you know, even that better stuff. Some of the new 2.4 might be the way you want to go just because, you know, transmit is a little better. But this one's not bad. I don't have interference that hinders the drive. It's just uh, sometimes you hear a little clicking when you're waiting around to drive it. But actually in drive, there's no, no problems. And now I'm just kind of going crazy and see how fast it goes. Oops. Little room here. It's just insane. <laughs> All right. Get one more big jump here. These jumps are fun. Well, that wasn't that big. Well, that was bad. <laughs> Let's get a big jump or two before we end the bit for the video here. That was kind of cool. Went off the side a little bit though. All right, here we go. Ah, not bad. That's probably one of the better ones. <laughs> Micro does it truck, any questions or comments, let me know. Happy RCing, and we will see you all later.